Are you looking for the best guessing games? I've got one right here. I played this as a kid, so much fun. We gave it to our kids for Christmas and they are loving it. And I wanted to talk to you guys about it today. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that I like, use, and have and give as gifts. So if you're interested in that, you might wanna consider clicking that subscribe button. So obviously the classic guessing game is guess who? And if you guys want to check this out, I'm gonna link it up down in the description below because this was one of my favorite games uh, playing as a kid and we've now given it to our kids and they are having so much fun playing it. So if you guys don't know what Guess Who is, basically you get this board and it's got all these flaps on here. I think you have to assemble the flaps. You got to put that together and you got to punch out all the little cards to, uh, to get all the people's faces. But basically you have rows and rows of people's faces just like so, oops. <laughs> and then there's a blue one as well. So you have the blue one open, you have the red one open. It's only a two person game. Or I guess you could play as a team if you wanted to, if you have like four people or whatever. Uh, but each person gets a, a rack and then there's a bunch of cards with all the people that are in there. And so what you do is you pick a card and you put it right here on the front and then your opponent picks a card as well. So this is your person. So your opponent is trying to guess the other person, but you, you, don't, you, you can't just guess one by one. You gotta ask questions. I hear you, you wanna play the game too? Look who's here. There he is. I'm almost done. So <clears throat> uh, what you do is you have to ask yes or no questions. So like, is your person a boy? And this one in our case is no. So they would go through and they would knock down all of the boys. Then uh, they, it would be their turn. And the object of the game is to try and guess who <laughs> they have. So once you go through boy or girl, that's a pretty easy one to do. You can say like, um, is your girl wearing a hat? And so they might say, let's see, ours is no. So you would knock down all the ones with a hat. And so, uh, then another good one, good question for this one would be, is your person wearing glasses? This would obviously be a yes, and there's not too many people wearing glasses. So you have to find those features that, uh, that can really help you to knock down a whole bunch of them. This leaves us with two. So you can ask, does she have white hair? Or, uh, you know, does she have white hair? And uh, the answer is no. So you know that that person is Donna. And so Donna would be the answer. Now, if you have a couple of like, let's say you have something like this, or let's do like this, two people left. And you want to, um, you want to take a guess because it's the other person's turn and they know who your person is. You can try and guess, but if you guess and you and you lose, you get it wrong, you lose. And then there's a little scorekeeper down here on the bottom, uh, zero, one, two, three, four, and five, so that you can keep track. I guess the object usually is to play about five games. It's a what I like about this game too is it's a quick game. It's like Spot It. If y'all remember Spot It, I'll link that up right up there. Uh, that's another great quick game that you can play with your kids. It's fun, gets them ener energized and engaged and and thinking, which is what I really like about this game. Um, so if y'all are looking for these great fun kids games to play uh, that are some quick games, I'll link up some of those right up there as well. You guys can go and check out some of these, but we're just having a blast playing this game. I remember playing it as a kid and we just absolutely love it. Now, I will say one thing that you're going to want to do is if you uh, have been playing this for a while and you've had your cards kind of set up in the same configuration, every now and again you might want to pop these out and move them around because whenever you get your card you're going to be like, okay, I've got this person, let me put down this one and the other person might be like, oh, second row, third person, I know exactly who that is. So just something that you might want to think about. Um, but all in all, great game, highly recommend it. One of my absolute favorites. I'm gonna link it up down in the description below. And I wanna know down in the comments below, what are some of your favorite games that you played as a kid? Um, maybe we can come together as a community of dad, and really, really have that nostalgia feeling for some of these games like Clue and Battleship, Guess Who, Monopoly. Just so many great games out there. So I wanna know some of your favorites. Uh, I'm gonna put some more games right there on the screen if you guys wanna check out more of the other game reviews that we've done. I'll make one of those spot it so you guys can go and check that out. Um, thank you dads for watching. That thumbs up is always appreciated. 
There's the baby again. I think he's ready for something. And dad out. <laughs>